sometimes we overemphasize to be clear. And when we're saying errors, you will, you know, there, there are 15 errors on this page. It, oh, oh my God, I got another one of these error worksheets. I got to do this error worksheet. If you were talking with a student, mm -hmm. they, they would probably say that. Oh, do we have to do errors again? I did, I did five errors. I did five errors. Isn't that enough? No, you have to do all 15 errors. So when you're speaking to the student, you're still projecting as if you're talking to a hundred people. Mm -hmm. you, but the student is casual to you. Oh man, I don't feel like doing any more errors. I did, I did two errors, all right? I did two of the questions, it's enough, right? No, I want you to do all, at least five of these errors. So, as an English teacher, we are projecting, even when we're only talking with one person. Mm -hmm. Yes. Th this is the difficulty. Mm -hmm. Because yes. the student wants to speak like a typical American person. Also, when we say error, we're communicating that the air is the important part. We always have a stress and an unstress. And so, thank you for working with yourself. Yeah, thank you. <laughs>